You know, being devoted to something means giving everything, everything that you have. And we give that to our family. We give that to the things that we, that we love to do. I mean, it's going to be an adventure every single day that we carry out into the outdoors or on the lake, on the ice. Each and everything that we do, we have that, that devotion. We can't thank the man above enough for what he's given us here and all these cool, awesome experiences that we have. That's, that's the true blessing that we really have in this whole thing. This is what this you is come why for. We're here. <laughs> that is, uh, Lake Lewood muskies are so pretty. They get that green phase to them. That is probably the biggest pike I've ever seen, man. Okay, I'll go up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. See you later, girl. Isn't beautiful? Oh my gosh. Got him? Come here, right here, get ready. She's coming in hot. Yep. Coming in fast. Yep. Yeah. 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 Nice one. Do it. Nice one, babe. That's her. I'm oh pretty sure. God. Muskie fishing is a special kind of fishing that can challenge you, it motivates you, and it can also play at your heartstrings. All right, well, we just got on the water here, and we are looking to go pound on some giant muskies. So they're out in the open water. They are thick out there right now, and we're really excited. Can't wait. We're gonna go pound some big girls. You know, when it comes down to muskie fishing, specifically early season musky fishing. It's really cool because we look forward to that every year, you know, as soon as that last day of musky fishing hits for the year, we're already looking forward to next year. And musky fishing is not easy, it's not supposed to be easy, and you're hunting big fish, you're going after, you're trying to get into the realm of a fish that's in a whole different caliber, and that's why we like musky fishing. to our first spot here. Um, we're in about 50 feet of water. Uh, you know, it's kind of funny when we first started doing this at first, uh, it seems like you're literally out in the abyss. You know, you're in the wide open. There's not a lot of structure. Um, but once you get out here open water fishing and you start to learn a little bit more about it, um, you can kind of figure out where those bait fish like to be. And if you can find the bait fish, you're going to find the muskies. So this has been a hot spot for us. We've been marking a ton of tulabies here uh, the last few days. And so this is where we're going to start. So we're setting up the GoPros here, you know, and one of the things that's kind of become really popular and really cool to be able to uh, see is your footage from the day of fishing. So, um, you know, the GoPro setup that we run is we've got two of them um, on the same top um, um, holder. So you, it works really good with the rail system here that I've got. Um, and it really would work good on pretty much any boat. So um, I'm just clipping them on here. And what I'm doing is I got uh, two GoPros, one's facing up front so it's catching Ashley, one's facing out the back so it's catching me. And I've actually got them plugged into my Dakota Lithium Power Box. This thing will run GoPros for days. Um, really sweet little tool, not only for just GoPros, but there's so many different options and, and uses for the Power Box. Um, it comes in handy all the time. So. 
Um, it's just really cool to be able to capture your your footage and that's kind of why we're doing the show obviously so um, we really like to do that and this helps capture the hook sets and stuff musky fishing isn't easy to film so um, every little advantage you can get to help you capture that moment you gotta take it so that's why we got the gopro set up and Hopefully you'll be able to see some hook sets here so soon. My bait of choice today is going to be the uh, beaver baits, man. Um, we've been throwing these ever since they came out and they work so well for open water fishing. Um, right here is the lake edition, so it's got the weighted head to it. Uh, works perfect when you're uh, out in open water. Uh, we, you know, I, I like to use it. I like to give it nice, uh, even rips. I know you can go in any different direction. There's kind of a lot of different ways that you can work it. You can work it fast, slow. Um, if you're noticing that uh, the bait's way far down, you can let it sink a little bit, kind of get farther down in the water column. Uh, so it's really a good, versatile bait to use, and uh, it catches muskies. So we're using uh, the Thorn Brothers Predator Rod. You know, Thorn Brothers has been around for a long time in the muskie industry. Um, a lot of people know about Thorn Brothers and they're a very customizable option when it comes to muskie fishing. Carry a lot of different options of baits and rods and reels and line, anything, anything you need for muskie fishing, Thorn Brothers has it, um, including the Thorn Brothers Predator Rods, which is what we're using today. Um, we're using the extra heavy, um, that's basically a really good all around rod. If you're looking to just purchase, you know, a rod for musky fishing, it's good for throwing bait, smaller baits, bigger baits. Um, if you're gonna be throwing a ton of bigger baits, the extra, extra heavy is, is a good option as well. Um, but the cool part about Thorn Brothers rods is you get to customize this thing from start to finish. So um, as far as the foregrip, the rear grip, the seat, the real seat, the colors of the threading, um, it's all customizable. Very, very cool options out there to make the rod of your dreams. So um, these rods are, are well known for um, being the elite of the elite for musky fishing. And um, you know, we just, we love them. They're awesome rods and, uh, and they work really well. So um, we're going with nine foot six. Um, I like the rods a little bit longer, especially fishing these bigger fish, bigger rod, bigger figure eight, bigger loops. Um, just kind of gets you that little advantage that you need when you're fishing these big fish out here. So um, Thorn Brothers, Predators, those are the ticket. See what it looks like in the water. Oh boy, I love yeah, that It looks tail. pretty good. Let's see what that that is a big chunk of rubber. So when we found a good group of bait fish, what we like to do is I'll cast out one side and John casts out the other. And so what that does is we kind of split the bait right in half. You're able to cover both sides of the boat. You can watch both sides with side imaging and kind of see what's out there. So it's a good way to cover more ground. Here comes one. Oh, it's a nice one too. That's a big girl. Whoa. Absolute freak. Came oh. Come on, girl. They should be chowing right now. They should be. found where all the bait is and we're marking up a bunch of muskies mixed in with them. Just don't think that they're quite ready to snap yet. We got about another hour and hour and 15 minutes before the miner. And I think now that we know where the fish are, I think we're gonna have a good few opportunities tonight um, with what we're seeing. Seeing a lot of fish starting to come off bottom a little more, the bait's starting to come up. Um, got a lot of, a lot of both uh, marked out right now, so. We're just going to kind of keep on making passes on this and just wait for that window to open up. There's a lot of fish down here. Lots of fish down here. Got one! Got him! Got him! That's him! That's her! 
Let's her, let's her, let's her, let's her, let's her. Yep, yep, baby. Ooh, yeah. Yep. That's her. Yep. That's her. Keep real. Keep tight. Yep, keep yep, tight. Keep, keep real. Keep, keep real, babe. Get up here on the deck. Get up here. Okay. Keep real. Here she is. She's right here. Oh, it's a nice one, babe. Oh, wow. Real nice yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Oh, boy. Keep her up. <laughs> nice, it's babe. It's a big one. Yep. Bring her up. Ooh. Bring her up. Bring her yep. up. Got her. Let's go! Ooh, yes! Yes! <laughs> yeah! Let's go! Side image Ooh. there, babe. Oh, my God. On the side imaging. Oh, Woo. that was crazy. Yes! That's a tank, babe. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. Oh, that's a nice one. That Ooh, is a tank. Caught her on the beaver. On the beaver. Oh my gosh. Gosh, that there's another awesome. one back there too. I know. We it's just crazy. We literally stopped. I we were gonna oh. I was gonna take a pee. <laughs> John's like, there's one right there. So, so I we skipped out. peeing. Yeah, so that can wait. Uh yeah, oh. but I, I went and cast it out at her and we marked another one on the other side and <laughs> she crushed it. Oh just my gosh, crushed oh it. yeah. That was awesome. We don't even have the trolling motor oh down my yet. Gosh, Here, hold her. Crazy. Hold her for All a right. second. I'm gonna get the trolling motor down. Ooh. Oh my gosh, that was freaking awesome. Oh my gosh. Woo! <laughs> Shaking. <laughs> Man, it's, we were casting for all day, you know? And all of a sudden, just like that. That's the best thing about musky fishing, is it just can happen that fast. <laughs> oh, that was That's awesome. a nice fish, babe. <laughs> yeah, it's super nice. Yes! Let's go! <laughs> Oh man, Ooh, we were just saying too, we've been seeing the bait fish yep. start to rise Everything up. is starting to look really good. So, yeah, starting marking more muskies in this area and we're like, you know, we're just going to stick to the same stretch. We've been marking a bunch. Everything's kind of getting active here and it's not even the minor yet. Just it's about getting to the Just minor. about there, but whoo. Okay. All right, go ahead and get okay. your rod and get that yeah. out of there. Here, let's grab that. All right, let's see here. Let's see here. Oh. Ooh, that's a big fish, Ooh, babe. Oh boy, oh my gosh. Oh, it's a Ooh. tank. This is a big fish, big fish. Holy buckets. <laughs> just go and sit right, Come sit right here, babe. Okay, holy cow. Oof, that's a giant. Yep, yep, I got oh it. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's a tank. Whoa. That thing is so Ooh. fat. <laughs> <laughs> that might be close Man. to 50, babe. Yeah, it's a big that's fish. It's a tank. Oh boy. That thing is so heavy. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that head. Oh, yeah, she's muskies. just thick. Open water Open muskies. Water muskies. So much fun. <sighs> Honestly, awesome. it doesn't get any better than it this. It doesn't. This is one of my I mean, favorite ways to fish. That fight right there represents exactly what happens out here in the open water. Those fish are so violent out here. Yep. They're coming out here for one reason, and that's yep. to eat. You know, and yeah. it's the Hold way on. they eat out here is just crazy. It is. I mean, she crazy. absolutely crush it. That's what Gosh, they do. Gosh, it's a giant. All right, All right let's get her in. Oh, there you go, babe. Here you go. <laughs> oh my what gosh, that thing's fish. a tank. Give her just a minute. Oh. Wow, thanks for the fight, girl. Go see you later, girl. See you later. Oh, it's a beautiful fish, babe. Woo! Woo! There, there she goes. goes. <laughs> the wave goodbye. <laughs> see you later, girl. That's awesome. There she goes. <laughs> <Woo> yes! <laughs> that oh. is fun! Let's go get Woo! another one! Let's do it again! <laughs> what a rush! That is why we do it right there. Oh my gosh. That is so much fun. I mean, you know, we love musky fish. Like any kind of fishing, we love all fishing, but there's something special about open water fishing for muskies. I mean, you see right there, it's, it's insane. It's so much fun. That was awesome. So sweet. You gotta love the hummingbirds mega side imaging, man. I'm telling you, it's unreal. Such an unreal tool. We've caught so many fish because of it. Um, you mark them and you literally cast back to them and there you go, prime example, fish on. So, pretty sweet. That was such a fat fish. That thing was so healthy. Put up an awesome fight and uh, bait's looking amazing right now. The window is opened up right now and we're gonna sit here and we're gonna crush on these babies. There's a lot of fish here. We're marking a lot of fish. We're marking a lot of bait. So everything's looking really good for a couple more fish yet here tonight. So It's really cool, the more you musky fish, how you can really start to put all those patterns together. And you know, one of the things that we really talk about when it comes to big fish is early season and late season. Don't get me wrong, you can catch big fish all year long, but for some reason, it just seems like the best opportunities that we have every single year that are the most consistent are 
early season, open water slash shallow, and in the fall when those fish are also open water and shallow. And a lot of that has to do with chasing the bait fish. You know, there's the lakes that we fish, we're pretty fortunate to have uh, Cisco-based lakes. And with that means big muskies. I mean, these muskies are, it's like eating Big Macs and these things are out there chasing them, you know, and, and wherever the bait's gonna be is where the fish are. And so fall or spring, you know, a lot of it correlates with those with those Cisco's. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a big greasy meal for them, and it helps yeah. put on pack on a lot of pounds before fall or right after the spawn when they're hungry. And yeah. so, yeah, that's a, a really good uh, bait. That that if you're looking for big muskies, that's a good bait fish yeah. to find. Well, we just got on the water. We're heading out this morning. Um, it's a bit of a cool morning, so we got our yeah. layers on. Uh, we're gonna head out and yeah. see where these muskies are at this morning. So we're that's gonna our find game plan. Them. We're gonna find them. They're there. We know where they're at, and yeah. we're gonna get them. It's where cold, but it's a little cooler this morning, so hopefully that gets them fired up this morning. We're thinking that some fish are probably kind of gonna be shallow, or it should be a good little shallow. But we're gonna go try that, and yeah. then it should be fun. All right, here we go. Game on. Hold on to you. that there's a little bit of a window, so. Oh, here comes one. Here comes one. Oh yeah, here it comes. Oh, look at that wake, here it comes. He's right on it. It's still there, still there. Oh, man. God dang it. Did you see that wake? That was a sweet wake. <laughs> that was wow. sick. That was sick. <laughs> oh. Wow, shoot. Dang and, like, it. It did one of those things where it shot yeah, down, I know it. and then you, like I made that first turn and just shot right back up I on it. I know it. I'm surprised it didn't eat. I thought I it was going to for sure eat on that. Me too. That Dang. Thing was right I was on. just like, oh, here it comes. It's coming. Oh. Change the direction a little bit, babe. Change it a little bit, just slow. Oh my gosh, that was a big fish. Uh, Holy, that was a mega <laughs> giant. Oh. oh. Are you kidding me? All right, we're gonna pull back up to this big one that we just saw a little bit ago. Ashley had it come up on her top water. Yeah, it came back out of the water and and it didn't. It kind of took a little swipe at it, and, but it didn't really follow in too much. So we're like thinking maybe if it didn't expend too much energy, yeah. we could come back to yeah. it, you know. And we're right on moon, so we're gonna hit it just perfect timing and. Yeah. We kinda, hopefully we can get her. Yeah. She was big. She is really big. So, gotta go after those ones. For sure. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We're gonna give her heck here and see if we can't get her here. Let's get her. You gonna throw the tomahawk again? Yeah. Yeah, that's a good choice. I'm gonna go with the old wood tick here for this one, I think. Come on, baby. Let's go, big girl. Let's get her. Let's get her. It's a giant. Here, right here, babe. Yep. Right here. Right here, babe. Right here. Babe, right babe. Yep. Get that net ready. You ready? Yep. Okay, here we go. I'm bringing her over. Oh, here, hold on. Right here. Okay. Hold on. Get it ready. Here, here. Yep. Right here. Here we go. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice one. Giant. Nice one, babe. That's her. 
I'm pretty oh sure gosh. that's her. Oh my oh gosh. Oh my babe. gosh, is that a giant baby? Woo! <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <coughs> oh my gosh. She just inhaled that Woo! thing. Oh my, oh gosh. my gosh, babe! <laughs> you. Did you see that go. thing's head come out of the water? That was insane. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Woo! Woohoo! Yes! <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. Here, grab hold this. On. I'm gonna grab my rod, Chris. Can you hold me for a minute? Oh, that is a mega giant. Whoa. That is a big fish. Oh my gosh, we literally just we we're just coming up to that waypoint where Ashley had this fish come up like 20 minutes ago. It came up and it tried eating her top water. And uh, we all we could see was the back on it, and it was big. We knew it was big, and so we gave it like 20 minutes, and we came back right on moon phase, and she just inhaled that wood tick. Oh my gosh! <laughs> yeah. Nice that was there. such a sweet, sweet fight. Did you see her come out of the water? I did. That was oh insane. my gosh, oh my is that gosh. awesome? Woo. So, oh, that's so cool. It's important when you are handling a fish that you make sure you get everything ready. I'm going to wash off the bump board a little bit. We like to do that to protect the slime on the outside of the fish. Um, you know, especially a, a fish of this size. I mean, they get this way for a reason because people handle them correctly, properly, do the right things. So we're gonna get everything set up so when he gets this uh, big girl out of the net that we're ready and we won't have to have her out of the water too long. I'm telling you, we've, I just, you know, we've been throwing this bait for a while now and it's been known for big fish, but man, it is on fire the last, last couple weeks with big fish, man. And, we have got a special, special fish in the net right now. Like this is, this is a very special fish. Oh baby, we gotta put our hands on her. This fish is a absolute mega giant. Oh, oh my gosh. Look at the head on that thing. Oh my gosh, look at that fish. Oh my gosh, it's a giant. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. Look at the size of that fish. Wow. That thing is absolutely <laughs> mega giant. This is what we were after, yes, man. It, was. it took us a while to get there and we lost some fish, but this is what it's all about yep. right here. This it's it. unbelievable. <laughs> so that's why we do it right gosh, here. Look at that thing. This is such a good fish, man. I, this is what you work for so hard. You put in all the hours and the efforts and so many missed fish, lost fish. And then you get a fish like this, and it is. This is it. what it's all about right here. This awesome. thing is unbelievable. Sweet fish, huh? Yeah. All right, let's get her back. Oh my gosh, look at this fish. Look oh. at that fish. Oh, Beautiful. man, look at her. Look at that belly. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. Look at that thing. Oh. Nice playing, girl. Wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is such a beast. Look at the That's belly amazing. on that thing. Oh man, thanks for playing, girl. Oh, we'll see you later. Wow. Oh my gosh, baby! <laughs> yes! Look at her go! Oh, that is awesome. Way to go! That is so awesome. Woo. That is what it's about right there. Yep. Oh, Woo. Yes. <laughs> oh. Oh. Woo! Awesome. So sweet. Talking about this show being a big fish show, it was just that. That one that you got was an absolute slob, and the one that I caught was an unbelievable fish as well. Absolutely, yeah. I mean, if you're, you know, whenever you're out musky fishing, uh, it's important if you're looking to, to focus in on big fish specifically. Uh, you know, as we've said before, this is really a time that you can be successful catching big muskies. So we wanted to share some of our tactics with you guys, ways that we find some of our biggest muskies, and uh, yeah, how to get after it out there in the water. For sure.